welcome back if you're watching this on youtube we continue our stronghold warlords adventure we're beginning a brand new chapter of the campaigns the mongol campaign coming of the mongols genghis khan mission one an unstoppable force genghis khan leads an assault on the tartars alongside his ally uh, on khan mission briefing for centuries nomadic tribes have roamed across the vast expanse of the steppes it is a difficult and unforgiving life for the disparate Mongol tribes who have remained leaderless in the decades following a devastating war with the Tatar clan. When Temujin's father was killed in a Tatar raid, he and his family were abandoned by their clan. Still a boy, Temujin endured years of survival in the wilderness before slowly bringing together his own following of exiles and wanderers. Now, he seeks to give the Mongols a Khan worthy of uniting under. Temujin summoned his followers to a Kuriltai by a sacred mountain to anoint him as Genghis Khan, ruler of the Mongols. However, the claim of Genghis Khan was contested by his childhood friend and sworn blood brother, Jamuka of the Jadaran tribe. Jamuka had more supporters among the Mongols and routed Genghis Khan's warriors when their armies met. But Genghis Khan would not give up his claim. Now, he leads his horse riders on a joint campaign against the Tatars with his ally, Ong Khan of the Karyit clan, in hopes of rebuilding his following. Dun dun dun! May the blue skies guide you, and you. So we must prepare, build stables, and recruit mounted troops to aid with the attack. I can hear you all screaming, no Lionheart, not cavalry, no! <laughs> attack, defeat the Tartars with the aid of the Karyid, and protect the Lord at all costs. Playing this on hard difficulty, let us begin! I feel it, we can do it this time. This is attempt number four, attempt number five, it's been hard. People on YouTube watching this for the first time, I'm only showing you the winning the winning attempt but it's been tough it's been tough today i will avenge my father for his death at tartar hands but yeah a message genghis from genghis khan today into your keep. i will avenge my father you've, for you've, his death at tartar hands you've, you've you've already told us that i guess can't blame you though you're probably pretty upset that your father did die by Heart of hands and you want revenge right lots of horse lords um let's go after this one this horse warlord first try and grab him and then we've got to break into and smash the defenses of the tartars up here but they have a lot we have an ally up here as well but they're not going to do much right let's set them up like that We've tried Archer Span, we've tried Horse Archer Span. We nearly won on the Horse Archer and Cavalry Spam. We have Horse Archers at our disposal, Excellence. These skilled archers can fire while moving and at great range. We got overwhelmed on the final push with my most successful attack. So let's give it another go. So I've got one consulate now. I've got those lances getting me production early. We'll need to get stables out as well. And I'm going to pull these guys back, I think, to sit up here. Gonna make a palisade funnel to corral them. Uh, I think they'll just attack the barricades. Seeing as they cost fifty wood, it's qu that's quite a large um, investment to try and like funnel them down somewhere. Not really something we could try at the start. We need to get more rice, more rice farms. Uh, we can increase taxes as well. How are we doing in terms of diplomacy on this guy? Grabbing this warlord. We're getting there, 60 out of 120. Oh, 
Oh, you know when the sun suddenly goes behind a cloud and and the the shift in like just brightness just obviously drops. Just have that. I just feel I just feel the room got quite a lot darker <laughs> behind me. <laughs> the Tatars are launching an attack, Excellence. Yes, of course they are. I need to get that military academy out so I can start putting out horse archers because they come from here. Kind of disappointed that you don't, you're not able to recruit them by getting bows and then cavalry uh, and stables. We should be alright for this first attack because the warlord's troops over here should keep them busy. But we'll need more soon. Yeah, I'm just going to go big on rice early so we can get our a lot of that and increase our excellency. supply of that. There's no point me adding in the meat just yet. Um, not until we've got enough actually that I could increase that twice. So it might be an idea to build up the pig farm as well. Although we should also get some stables out soon so that can just tick over. But I want to get another consulate actually. So many things I want to get. Um, I think actually we can tweak that. Yeah, so there and just hold it level at five. Give us enough to get me another consulate. That'd be fine. Appreciate it, last switching out. Enjoy Asterix. Maybe save for one embassy first before getting the four consulates. Uh, what's the difference? That is... Let's just tell me what I get. I think saving up 500 early on. I need the money to be able to throw at, uh, at horse archers. So I think I'm just going to get one more consulate for now. And then spam out a load of horse archers for a bit. Just because that's quite a lot to save up when we need it for the, for the mercenaries basically. There we go. Right. Then all spare money goes into that. Um, I think I will start building up. I'll get some more pig farms, actually. Reckon if I have two more, then that'll be enough to be able to increase the rate for both. Our rice stocks are dwindling, Excellency. In fact, I can check, can't I? We are under attack. Here we go. Should be enough to defeat these guys. But they are sending more troops in. Go on, get them. Go, archers, go. Bring them down, bring them down, bring them down. One target at a time. Go, go, go. Get back. Just so my other archers can get in range. Come on. Okay. Way to put my feet up in my comfortable home, Highness. Our rice stocks are dwindling, Excellency. We can definitely increase that. There we go. That should be enough. Um, May daily is 48. They're eating, yeah, quite a lot. The rice, May daily, eaten daily. If I can increase that. Yep. Oh, just over. Damn. So we don't need to increase that then. Unless we drop that back. Oh no, we hold. Wow. Nice. That's pretty good. Uh, we are a limited people. Yeah, let's get a house there. That'll increase the number of mouths to feed, but that should still be manageable. Sending more in. Can I demand obedience? I can. Good. We 
can use our diplomacy on this one to send us reserves. I think I might still actually upgrade this one first to give me the... Auxiliary. I think that worked best just because this one's constantly going to go back and forth between me and the AI and the Tartars. So yeah, I think we'll stick with what worked, which was grabbing, get, upgrading this warlord to give me more pronto. A most compelling offer. I can get a consulate, but I think I'm actually going to need to get a load of horse archers right now with all that money. So yeah, they're coming in. We should get reinforcements soon, though. It looks complex. Um, it's not too complex. Kind of once you've mastered the the basics of you know what produces what and what units are good against others. It's just that in the at least in the first three campaigns, the game doesn't let you recruit all all available units. Just um, essentially ones that thematically makes sense for that campaign so you don't have access to like walls in this one obviously defensive would be really really useful right about now Not enough gold to train this unit. come on hit them there you help your people Genghis Reinforce oh god, okay. It's any more. We should get reinforcements any second though. The Lord is being attacked. Go back in here. Any minute now, reinforcements would be great. <laughs> we are under attack. Let's go again, just go. Our ally Ong Khan has sent reinforcements. Hey, here we go. Charge! Kingus, get back up there. Annihilate them. Go, go, go. Our rice stocks are dwindling, Excellency. Ah, we're doing fine. Need more cavalry. Hey, Simple J, how you doing? I well, gotta be careful with Genghis because if they just send in horse archers, then they'll um, annihilate, annihilate him. Ah, sending more across. Need more taxes, my lord. Can get the horse archers, but I still feel like the consulate's going to be the better choice right now. Get us more diplomacy. I can get some. I still need four. Upgrade again. Is it this level week? No, they're still at four. But yes, yeah, upgrade that as quickly as we can. They'll be kept busy there for a little bit longer. Our rice stocks are dwindling, excellent. How are we doing? Made daily. Stored. Yeah, okay. I'll wait for the next next round. Made daily. Oh wow. It's because it ebbs and flows, doesn't it, with um with obviously having enough pigs to slaughter. It's keeping them busy. Got the day off with pay. Nice. Happy days. I might even go might even go for the last consulate actually just get that out. Get that out now. How much are we producing? Diplomacy, 42 a minute. Come on. Boom. Now it's 54. Our rice stocks are dwindling, Excellency. Let's 
still keep him busy with him. Uh, yeah, upgrade you again. Still four. Another Tartar invasion is incoming, Highness. With more riders still. Oh, goody. That's what it's going to get. Fun. Keep you guys back here so they've got to come all the way in. Got 18 lances. That's good. We just need to, need to get uh, some stables up and running, which we actually we can do now. Up row. Wait until they get really close and go after them. In fact, I'm going to go after the horse archers first with my Imperial Cavalry. Because they're the biggest threat against Genghis. Here we go. Oh, they've got even more horse archers coming. Go, go, go. We are under attack. Come on. Oh, you're down. That's not good. Get him, Genghis. Got anyone available now? God, this mission. Can't use barricades to fuck no, because they can attack barricades and chop them down still. And they cost, as I said, 50 wood each time. So you would need so much wood to be able to do that. Our ally Ong Khan has sent reinforcements, excellence. Hey. Reinforcements just in time. Okay, we can now get six every 80. That's good. I think we've done just enough to hold long enough to survive. Just need more people in the castle now. Our rice stocks are dwindling, Excellency. As you wish. And we're going to want to move on this one soon. And on the stable when we've got more wood in. Weapons needed, Highness. No point getting the, the tribesmen though, just won't do anything. It takes ten seconds to get that. Um I think I'm just I rather than capturing another warlord right now. I think I'm just gonna keep spitting out relief forces. Oh, definitely gonna need it. Wow. Chase them away. Needed,highness。小魏，保持密集队形。齐行，朝野狗开火。As Okay. 
Give a tactic, draw him in, and then push him back. Oh, I think we can start doing it. Just got to keep things going. Could definitely increase that. Can we increase taxes? Just about, I think. Give it a go. Double rice rations. Double rice do rations. Yep. You do love the double rice rations. I get some more cavalry. As you wish. We can do it. We can do it. This this time it's gonna work. This time it's gonna work, he says. Okay, more cav, please. We'll get maybe one more and then I'll save up for the embassies. Our rice stocks are dwindling, Excellency. Weapons needed, Highness. Um, I much, feel like a king with this house. How much wood do you excellence. add each time, actually? So we're at 35 right now. Well, quite a lot. Go. Okay. Our ally Ong Khan has sent reinforcements, Excellence. There we go. That'll do it. Setting some infantry next. Yeah, we've got enough for an embassy, so I'm going to chuck one out now. Oh, hello. Charge! I serve a new master. Please charge. Get him. Yikes. Oh, get stuck in there, guys. Yeah, we got wrecked there. As you wish. Weapons needed, Highness. Oh, just done. Just done enough damage to deal with them. Right, let's go capture this guy to draw the enemy back in. Oh. 
this is easily the hardest mission we've had in the game so far. Not enough gold to train this unit. Let's go spam some horse archers for a bit, I think. Never seen such immaculate housing, Your Excellency. Not enough gold to train this unit. We are under attack. Again. No, it's the same attack. <laughs> As you wish. As you wish. Just farming you guys for cavalry. There we go. Just did it. Not enough gold to train this unit. I need to let the meat supply build back up again. But I can still sell some rice. Yes, a little bit more. Not enough gold to train this unit. This is the fifth. This is the first mission of the Mongol campaign. Yeah, actually. In a way, it's kind of, is there much point in me producing my own when I, my own cavalry when they can do it for me? With diplomacy. So at the moment, I should probably just try and save up so that I've got Our rice stocks are dwindling, enough of that last consul, uh, that last embassy, and then it's uh, just ticking over in the background, isn't it? Let's go mental with taxes for a little bit. Because we've got seven people sat there. Then drop it back down. Get maximum gold. There we go. Then let it build up a couple of people again. Then we increase it. Then we drop it back down again. You're telling the warlord to attack the others just isn't worth it. Um, it costs... He only sends three units with his attacks. It's... it's just too small an amount. Better to save up and just... Get the, uh, the six cavalry units each time. Alright, I'll meet. There we go. So we can increase things. Again, let's get me that 500 gold. Oh boy. There we go. Perfectly balanced. There we go. Right now, all, all the money can just come to me for my troops.
Horse archers go hit him. Two more cavalry forces. And then they're sending these guys over here. I think let's start trying to capture this guy. Warm them up. I've been here a long time, Highness. Will my skills be needed soon? Our rice stocks are dwindling, Excellency. We are under attack. Charge! That's a reasonable tip as well for the for warlords is don't have all your troops just in one group to attack with. Have them in multiple because they don't seem to kind of be that responsive in. Once they deal with the initial target you sent them after, they don't necessarily give chase that easily. The enemy approach. Weapons needed, Highness. I am under attack. I think it's better to have multiple uh, multiple groups than just one single group. Connet, as I've already said, there's no point in using the warlords to do attacks. They'll send six horse archers and three imperial cavalry, and they cost 150 and 300 each. It's way better to get the six auxiliary cavalry with the 80 diplomacy. The attacks are just way too weak to do anything effective here. On this map, at least. We'll grab grab that one next once we've got this one. There we go. Demand obedience. So I can start going after this guy in the middle. I serve a new master. Weapons needed, Highness. A most compelling offer. There we go. Cavalry takes out all the horse archers. Then I'm going to pull back. Take out that fire arrow car. Otherwise, we're in for a world of pain. Down. We got him. That one's mine now as well. I mean, the only way it would be worth worth doing those launch attacks is if you built up so much diplomacy that you could tell all of your warlords to do the launch attack at once, but then you'd need like 1,200... 1200 diplomacy points, which would take an age to store up. Get some superior housing in there. 
，他们必败。我们兵强马壮。Get that one in the middle, which will give me all those troops. Although I won't be help, I won't have direct control over them. Still harass them a bit. No, you don't have any any way to heal up your troops. Or at least, if there is a way, we haven't found it yet in three campaigns so far. Go to see Lunhart. Use Cav effectively. <laughs> Does upgrading the warlords improve their attacks? Um, no. So this one is um, easy to improve launch attack. I think it's just that one rather than that one. I think I, I got it up to rank six before, didn't I? We'll try upgrading him again, but all of these seems to just send out six and three. I'm pretty sure we got it to its maximum level before. Oh wow, we can get loads of horse archers now. Beautiful. Peasants needed, Highness. We do have we've got fairly optimal gold production now, which is nice. Uh, in fact, actually, go claim this one for me again. Nearly got that one. So we're producing 114 diplomacy, which is our maximum rate. Our rice stocks are too Ooh, expensive. we are real low on rice though. Yeah, all this tax, this high rate of tax does come at a cost. We need more rice farms. Can't place that there, Highness. Once they get up and producing, that should be enough. So I'll leave everything as is for the moment. Weapons needed, Highness. Peasants needed, Highness. Okay, demand obedience. Now let the diplomacy flow. Just about working. Okay. Go get him. What do we need? More auxiliary cavalry and more horse archers. They've been wiped out of their forces. That's fine. I was going to try upgrading this guy, wasn't I? Rank 6 is max level. That, oh, it sends out 5 Imperial Cavalry now, so I hadn't upgraded it before. That makes it slightly more useful. We'd probably want to do that at the same time we launch an attack. But I'll still probably buff up my, my force with some more Auxiliary Cavalry before I go. From Genghis Khan. It is time to move out. Ride, warriors. Sure. I mean, I would, I wouldn't mind some more warriors, to be honest. 
I'm not going to lie. Some more would be nice. Oh, they've got an arrow cart over there. That's nice. How would they even get that? Is that just appearing? They don't have a siege camp. The enemy approach. I am under attack. Not enough gold to train this unit. So they got more spawning in over there. I serve a new master. The enemy approach. So loop them around here. Not enough gold to train this unit. As you wish. The enemy approach. A message from Genghis Khan. Do you feel the ground shake beneath your feet? When my horses ride, the earth tremors, and the people know that fear has come. We are under attack. I actually just thought you were fighting. The enemy approach. As you wish. Just keep building up all my forces. Keep on doing. Oh, my food is really out of it. Okay, I'm going to have to lower that and the rice rate. We just don't have enough to keep up with it all. Unless I build more rice farms, maybe. Not enough gold to train this unit. Okay, it's stuck in. As you wish. I think I've probably got to look to do an attack soon to clear out this side. But I've got to make sure I've got enough troops ready to be able to keep on going. Or, because mine are going to get slowly whittled away by all the uh, smaller attacks, I think. Why are you guys going so slow? Thanks, Pacant Squalot. Let's go. Genghis, no. Back. Bad Genghis. What do you reckon, Twitch chat? Try and attack on the western defences or hold off until I've got more troops.
definitely going to throw in a save here, though, rather than having to do it again each time. Override saved game. Yes. Weapons needed, Highness. Please order, Lady. Lady Hui, we are following. Or troops. Charlie says charge. Enough gold to train this unit. Charlie's keen for some cavalry slaughter, I think. I mean, I w might, I might hold up my attack until I can do the launch attack with the with this one. Three hundred. Let's uh, increase the game speed a bit, and then try and time it with that. Maybe we'll have a bit more luck. Weapons needed, Highness. Let's give that a go. Yeah, Wolvens, this is our this is our fifth attempt at doing it. <laughs> our ally Ong Khan has sent reinforcements, Excellence. Way. That's good. Okay, let's slow the game speed down because otherwise these guys are gonna wreck me. That's a problem. Just get ready with a load of troops and then they spawn in some more. We are under attack. Did I bring up Genghis again? Yes. Keeps accidentally selecting him while we're down here. Not enough gold to train this unit. Yeah, we can request some Imperial Cavalry, but it's not requisitioning it. It's a launch and attack with them, so I don't get direct control over them. Otherwise, it'd be way easier. Um, I'm going to send a relief force. In fact, two relief forces. That'll give me the cavalry I've basically just lost. Back up here. Weapons needed, Highness. Our rice stocks are growing, Highness. Not enough gold to train this unit. Right. Let's do it. Launch attack. My army marches. Go. So when they initiate the attack on that side, I'll go in on this side as well. They've just got to go through these guys first. Oh, of course the enemy send troops in to attack at the same time. Just my ruddy luck. That's it, a tiger's tiger's attacking their own troops. Hit these guys with horse archers. Yeah, 
As you wish. As you wish. Cavalry. Weapons needed, Highness. Go, go, go. We can do this. I will win. Let's focus fire. Pick him off with the horse archer spam. There we go. Got our way through now. We've cleared the outer defenses. Move up this way. We are under attack. Okay, it's gonna cause some trouble. Not enough gold to train this unit. As you wish. As you wish. Damn it. Oh my god, they get this they get this force as well. See that's not fair. Ah, we nearly made it through. And they've got all these Imperial Cavalry now. The Lord is being attacked. Uh, it's the only way to deal with is basically horse archers. I might just try and ignore their troops. And you send my send my horse archers. Uh, what the hell? I didn't even know he was getting attacked. What? What? Gotta made that save. Ay ay ay! This mission. So yeah, someone got back here and was attacking me back there. I didn't even know who that was. Not enough gold to train this unit. Okay, more. More. Where Our rice stocks are dwindling, Excellency. Ay ay ay. Not enough gold to train this unit. Our ally Ong Khan has sent reinforcements, Excellency. 
敌人在哪儿？他们必败。保持密集队形。野狗，向敌人发射箭雨，骑马真好。快速前进，准备转向。领主，有何吩咐？我们朝何方急行？让他们粉身碎骨。遵命，谨遵命令。啊、这，我们兵强马壮。Going, just keep going, just keep going. Way more horse archers though, because we nearly we nearly did it with that push around the top. I think that's the way to do it. Just swing around this way and hit them. But in your butt, butt ton of horse archers. So I'm going to keep building up my force a little bit longer. I think all my horse archers can be together, but all my cavalry needs to be separate. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to request all the cavalry from him right now, and then save back up for the uh, for the 300. That's enough. 30 auxiliary cav we've just gained. Should be able to hold off against the next wave. Loads more horse archers. Our rice stocks are growing, Highness. Sell some of that wood. More horse archers. No, you can't do anything with your ally. All he basically does is occasionally send an arrow cart after them and every so often spit out some reinforcements down at your spawn. Start building up another horse archer army down here. How many troops have I actually got? Okay. Not bad. More gold needed. Our sell rice. Uh, I don't want to sell it because that's going to unbalance things here at the moment. We've kind of got it just about level. Here we go. Coming again. We are under attack. Not enough gold to train this unit. We two big groups now. Which is probably fine for the horse archers. For you guys, I want you in two groups. Okay, launch and attack. Send up more horse archers. This isn't the pig's castle. Yeah, the pig's castle I was never able to do on hard this difficulty. This one I reckon I can. I'll throw in another save from this point as well, I think. Override saved game. Yep. Three, two, one. Oh, wait, actually, I want to wait until these guys begin the attack. Just wait. Don't be hasty. We can probably sell a little bit of rice. I'd rather it just all build up, actually. And here we've got a 16, so I might as well save until I can get 16 horse archers rather than dribbling them all out. Hey, Daddy Diego. How you doing? 
Welcome, welcome. Right. Yeah, they're firing now. I want to keep this cavalry back because all we really want right now are the horse archers. Oh, no, crap. Of course, they're going to get an army spawning in. Horse archers have to pull back so we don't want to lose them. But we'll just keep firing. Doing lots of damage. Not enough gold to train this unit. As you wish, as you wish. Let's just go take out the rockets. The enemy approach. Ah, this is the attack, right? This is the one I missed. That's what I need to go deal with. That's what killed my lord previously. Yeah, just spotted it in time. Not enough gold to train this unit. As you wish. Not enough gold to train this unit. The enemy approach. Oh, wow, that charge. Oh, my God, they just obliterated all of my horse archers. Oh, my days. That's disgusting. Wow, they just ran through them all and just instantly knocked them all down. Bloody heck. Not enough gold to train this unit. We'll take out that Imperial Cavalry. I think if we can survive, if we can survive this attack, then I think we'll be able to press again. I don't think they'll be able to get... I think you guys are right that this attack is spawned in in retaliation to how we've just done cracking through the defenses up there. So if we can just hold them off here... Then I can rebuild and just face their wave attacks again. But I think I've got this. 
Oh, wow. Wow, 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 wow. Brutal. Right, yeah, we've done it. We've done it. Not enough gold to trade this unit. Uh, yeah, there'll be a CKC a CK3 stream Monday. This building is currently functioning. Um, it'll be more of the uh the new Rise of the North Sea Empire series. I just need to get my horse arch spam back on up again. Not enough gold to train this unit. Shall we? I think I'll say about diplomacy and tell them to do another attack. We are Keep them attack. busy. And then I can flank round here with all my archers. Pick them off. Max gold for a little bit. Will they spawn in another force? Peasants needed, Highness. My army marches. The enemy approach. Okay. Not enough gold to train this unit. Let's do it. Thank you, Merlin. I really appreciate it. Glad you've enjoyed it. The uh, slow but sure progression of the uh, content and channel. <laughs> the arms of the angels fly away, little horses. <laughs> Is it worth taking the final warlord? Uh, nah, I don't think so. Oh yeah, they just get they just get wrecked, don't they? Having no way to breach on in. Just in case things go horribly, horribly wrong. Mainly if they spawn some in behind. Main thing is breaking down these barricades, taking out those archers, clearing out the archers on the keep. Clearing out the archers down here. And then shooting their lord to bits. And then I win. Finally, it's only taken six attempts. Finally! <laughs> there you go, that's how you do this mission. <laughs> Yikes! Yeah, that was that was tough. I mean, now it seems fairly, relatively easy. You know, easy, you know what to do. It was hard working out that strategy. Ah, oh, victory! We have victory! 
Oh boy. So on to the second mission, which we will pick up next stream, where I'm hoping we'll get through more than just one in the whole stream. That'd be nice. If you're watching on YouTube, I hope you enjoyed this first mission. Till the next one. Ciao for now.